Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you a video to help you better understand the Model A. Please enjoy. Many people see the Ford Model A as the replacement for the Model T, but in reality it was just Henry Ford's survival plan. He never intended to replace the Model T with the Model A. Before I get ahead of myself here, I need to explain a few things about the Model T. The Model T and the Model A are very closely connected, and the history of the Model A cannot be described without the history of the Model T. Henry Ford was a very proud man, and he was very proud of his Model T. He barely upgraded it during its production. Since we all know that pride goes before a fall, the lack of upgrades would cause the Ford Motor Company to stumble. Because of the lack of upgrades, other auto manufacturers easily pulled ahead of Ford and produced better automobiles, like the Studebaker you see right now. After 1923, sales of the Model T developed a steady dropping pattern, and finally in 1927, Ford was forced to admit that he needed a new automobile. Ford didn't want just anything to replace his Model T. He wanted something completely revolutionary. After several experiments, he decided to build a car with a single cast engine block V8. But that type of engine would take several years to develop, and he needed a car to sell during that time. Thus came the Model A. When the Model A came out, Henry Ford had truly made a lady out of Lizzie. However, it did not take long for competition to catch up, and competition stayed ahead until 1932, when Ford released his V8 engine car. The reason competition pulled ahead was because just like the Model T, the Model A was given very few upgrades, and sadly, it never reached its full potential. Thanks to the Great Depression, the Model A was not able to reach its full sales potential either. Many people just didn't have the money to buy a new car. The Model A was the last car that Henry Ford would produce with minimal upgrades. When the Model A disappeared from manufacturing lines, a new era began, an era where manufacturers would fight hard to survive. Thanks for watching everyone. Until next time, please remember that history belongs to God. It's his story.